A piece of Bay City history, 810 Washington Avenue, the Nep Building, formerly a department store, now another rundown pile of bricks, perfect for Jennifer Acosta. There's a lot that's happened in this direct vicinity that we can really build on, and it has incredible character. Born and raised in Bay City and now living in Midland, Acosta is a real estate developer. She's restored other buildings like the Times Lofts and the Legacy. Downtown Bay City, when I when I graduated high school and, and was down here a lot, we didn't have what we have now. Her latest project is the NEP building. She gave TV5 a behind the scenes and sometimes in the dark tour. If you stand just right angle and get the light uh, all throughout, and they actually all have different patterns. So there's a sun, that one's wow, something else. So. The detail. The plan is to put retail on the ground floor and Airbnbs on the second floor. We'll actually um, bring in a different designer to do each one. They will all have a very unique look and feel. And the amenity package that we've built out around those two is, is exciting, and I can't wait to unveil that. We're on the fourth floor of the building. Obviously, the power isn't on yet. They plan on turning these into condos. Some of the ceilings are so high, those units will be two stories. Acosta hopes to have the retail spaces open late summer or early fall of this year, and the rest of the floor is done in about a year and a half. Material supply chain has been something that, that we're dealing with, so it's one of the reasons that we want to get in early and do all that design work and start ordering everything that we need in those long lead time items. The price tag, just under $5 million. In Bay City, Trevor Sahaki, WNEM TV5.